What's up, YouTube? This is Brewer Station here, and this is going to be episode 22 of season 2 of Jujutsu Kaisen. So, um, last time on Jujutsu Kaisen, uh, there's a part 2 of Ma, of 2v1, Ma, you know, Yuji in Toto versus Mahito. And Toto had, Toto's imagination was pretty fucking strong, huh? <laughs> I, apparently, this was not in the manga, that part. The the is the the staff decided to just put their spin on it because they, apparently they can't get enough total like most of us can't because apparently I because apparently I don't think from the looks of it he may show up any you know, he may show up much more after this I mean I've, well given the the state he was in I feel like he may be out of commission for a while unless if we can somehow heal him fast but enough but I don't know I. Is what it is, and the, that part with Mahito and, and Eugene, that was that was terrific. Um, unfortunately, of course, you, you, you it is kind of a frustration to see that Eugene was kind of playing with his food, but like it's not like he, he, you remember Yuji was not told by Toto that Ghetto had already taken the, the little prison realm, the little prison realm cube with him, which has Gojo in it, and now Ghetto shows up. Yuji, uh, Yuji was not expecting it because like if he was being told about it most likely he would have he would have um he probably would have hastened on it but if it was told about it but prior to he would have been still worrying about Gojo so that was a tough deal and remember get uh, all's ghetto it, but it's really Kenny uh Kenjaku. Sorry if this is a kind of a spoil, but you know what? Since it's false girl, I can't say false ghetto at this point. Kenny show he he they you have to realize like you have to wonder what happened between Mei Mei and um uh, and uh fate ghetto. So yeah, that's something to consider and unfortunately I don't the way it seems at the moment I don't think it went as very well. I I feel Meme is though, and I'm not trying to say my sister like that's how I say that's how I kind of refer to her in you know Cantonese sister. But sorry if this it feels so awkward. It feels so awkward for me to say it. Um, yeah, she yeah she's probably she was more or less on her own agenda like she's not. There's some they're not obligated to participate in. I don't know, like, maybe it's not the one that's supposed to be like, yes, yeah, she's on the good side, but she's not going to really go all in for the good side. And she comes off as, as such. So it wouldn't surprise me that she probably bailed out and just not willing to risk her life like most many other people would. Um, there's going to be some re more revelations, I'm pretty sure, with this one. <laughs> Hang in there, anime. Well, they probably may be done by now, hopefully. But damn, I, I there's nothing I could really do over there. I even the government can't do anything. Of, well, they're just fucking around, catering to older people, not really, not really being self-aware of their shit. I'm just like, come on, man. You really have to be. I know you have this sense, this this strong sense of like. I like how you do this whole thing. I like this, uh, you know, policy of like keep everything clean. I like this whole policy of like get shit, get shit done. I like this whole policy of like, oh, don't prepare about like. But of all the changes they allow, they allow the the worst ones influenced by the you know the other the other Western countries, which is annoying. But somehow, working cult their working culture is not is not taken away, is not you know is not dealt with. It's it's befuddling to me. But again, I, I don't have power. I don't really have any um. I don't know, I'm I'm just a voice. I in the end, I I really cannot say like no matter what I can say, I don't think I can really change anything unless if I unless if like the more people I act will actually listen, and I hope more people will listen, and I hope more pe and I hope the those people those higher ups would be like oh, well stop being so fucking stubborn and stuff and stupid. Yes, they're stupid. They, yeah, they're higher up. So they, does just because they're higher up doesn't don't mean they don't mean they they're smart. They just 
they they just didn't they just have wealth the wealth buys a lot and they're just being they're just making weird ass decisions especially with the whole shit with if, if you haven't heard like there one p there was a there's a really after that you know if anyone's heard about unless if you live on your bus which studio is making a remake is having a remake of one piece i'm like why 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 i get like yeah i'm happy that for some of my for some people it's gonna stop it's, it's not it's gonna make them stop resorting to going through hundreds and hundreds of episodes to get to the good to oh when it's gonna get good i just judge based on overall and i'm like yeah this yeah one piece is a mixed bag for me i don't hate it but it's just there you know but yeah they just want to get it to fix the pacings not have all these sort of fillers that was all the issues with the old with the old anime but you're just like really and then some of the questionable stuff that has been mentioned along with state-of-the-art technology yeah what the why do we need state-of-the-art technology Remember that this is with studio the same. Unfortunately, this is the same studio that produced an AI-generated anime, or released an AI-generated anime, and now they released an AI, an AI-generated sound song mixed with the one P with with other one piece you no know, soundtracks, and it's disgusting and it hurt my ears. It actually, it my ear, my 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 right ear is actually fucking hurting from after listening to that shit. It was gross. Like seriously, like I, I'm not joke. Like I'm not fucking joking. By the way, it. Yeah, but anyways, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop rambling about that because it kind of drifted off topic. So let me get to, let me get to here and get to start. And I do apologize if I seem um. Hold on. Did I download? Okay, yeah. Um. Okay, that was what I downloaded before. Never mind. Um. So yeah, about the thing about um. How I feel about Jujutsu Kaisen nowadays, I still like it, but I still really do enjoy it a lot. But I can't say I I. I am disappointed that I don't like or love it as much as I wish I could. Now, is it related to how I feel regarding, you know, the how the animators are, how the staff is treated, how the story in the manga is going, how um, there are things there are things I think think back on like yeah that wasn't too good, sort of deal. Yeah, but I'm not saying there are some. They, they don't have really, you know, amazing moments. It does. And that's why I still like it. It's just that it does have its sense of inconsistencies. You where you're like, eh, I'm I'm not so sure about this part and this part and this part with how they do the characters. And of course, people can I know many others will see this differently and say, Oh, then why are you so worried about it? like I am generally concerned about it, like with how they handle certain care uh, many of the characters. But in the end, like, as long as you enjoy it as much as you can, maybe even more than I do, mo I'm pretty sure well, most people still do, then that's fine. That's perfectly fine. I, I, am not, I have no hate for this. It's just, you know, when I have to think about what I'm going to put, what grade late, what late, what grade, final grade I have to do, that's a totally separate personal thing. And hopefully it doesn't concern you guys. Because... I don't want to dunk on anyone's parade in the end. Well, unless if you're a particular fandom, then you kind of get to, <laughs> then I hate to say this, but probably gonna, you probably get deserve to get dunked on. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and get this started. All right, uh, so hopefully I didn't, I upload the right one. Yeah, I did. Oh shit, I forgot I'm supposed to update this, fuck. Uh -huh. I'm gonna probably update it, you know, a little later. Alright. Alright, sorry for a long wait. 3, 2, 1, let's jam. Okay, that's how it goes off.
Oh yeah, that's the burnt out mo uh, esque Shira Tensei Meteor. <laughs> Bro, Shibuya is fucking done. But it just looks... It's literally Chernobyl. A gorilla panda. <laughs> what? <laughs> what are you saying there? <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, he didn't get told about how about the part where he where where Sukuna will take over if Sukuna's if Itotoi eats too many fingers at once. Oh, oh, damn it! But Panda didn't. Eh? Yeah. I, Unfortunately, yeah, it's become a problem because it's still Eugene's flesh that did. Oh, great! So that's where she been. Yeah, what in the Yosaka no Sora is this? What's this? So she, so they so they took the trip so they so they took the ticket out to sweet to Alabama. I see how it is. <laughs> yeah, I just ditched this place to boot. I don't think being the third largest economy is not going to be able to fix Shibuya overnight. If it can be fixed. Oh, what Chos that was Choso's name. Oh, Choso sees him as his brother. Because he had, because y he Yuji has kind of more or less has some of his brother's blood in him. Well, it's probably mistaken, but oh man, I'm glad they kept him around. I'm glad they kept him around and not send him home with his uh, with his two other brothers. Oh, jeez, that music again. Nah, Kara's gonna steal. Oh, girl's gonna steal his. <laughs> what's Ken? I um, was 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 Kenny. I mean, Gero, What's he gonna do? Oh, wow. Oh, we got transport away. That's the power of that catfish. That's why I used Getro's body. Oh, he healed. Oh, they healed that up real quick, huh? Well, hopped over it.
Ai, ai, ai. The CG and the bugs just makes it a lot more, a lot more unnerving. Oh, Utah. If only he didn't, if only he didn't send away Utah. That's just, that's fucking foul. Yuji's already kind of, there's already ha- There's already like- b Like empty in the tank. Oh, nope, Marito, you're done. He's using- Both turning him into a fucking pokeball. That was my kill! What to talk about? I have the opening has that. I want to skip the opening for once, but hey, you know what? Just just a break. <sighs> I think I think Kyoto the Kyoto class are about to swoop in, aren't they? They did say they they did seem like you're gonna get the jump and get involved. Okay. It was a maki. About to use it. Fucking Kenny. So it's just like one big mass. No technique whatsoever, it's just... Well, usually in it, uh, it is. Okay, that would make sense. Extraction of techniques. Oh dear, this don't look good. Oh, they did, yeah, they did came. No, that's not working.
No, Gano's way too much for them. But... <laughs> Wait, is that me was talking? Uh, Miwa didn't choose to. Miwa didn't choose to become a source. Like. <laughs> Miwa is just. Uh, is outmatched at this point, though. Oh! Oh dear, don't tell me. Off, oh, she gave, he gave her the eyes and treatment. Oh fuck. Oh, ew. Oh. oh, no, 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 no. Who's that? Oh. <laughs> now is not the time to argue. It's like, please tell me not to do Yep, he's he do. <laughs> Panda. He's just like, please tell me you're screwing. Hey, what's up? Yep, he's the other. <laughs> Oh boy. Oh dear. The guy you fought earlier. So he, so that tale was him talking about him, literally mentioning talking about himself. No, not the current one. Of course not. Oh shit! Everything's fucking ridiculous at this point, man. <laughs> I mean, he is practically main antagonist at this point. It was... Oh, uh, so it's not even Kamo. So it's probably not even a Kamo. Probably someone who took over Kamo. Oh, man. Oh... Yeah, man, huh? Damn, she is pissed. Veins on his. Okay, yeah, that's why you can send someone use. That's why you can sense him back then. Of 
course they reanimate this part. Bro, this music is... Wow, that's a one of... Fucking Robocop looking ass. You know that one fucking brain dude? Yeah, but better than yours. Oh! I was able to block it, is my question. <sighs> Damn, Chos was really going at it. Wow. Oh man. Yeah. It reminds me of one thing that uh the the Uhana used that looked like a man ray. I forgot what the name was, sorry. Yeah, what the f Yeah, what the fuck is Stone Lion? <laughs> Great stone dragon! Oh, you got the day. Oh, that's, oh, that's sick. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, magic reflection mirror, whatever. Oh, wow. <laughs> He's driven by range, though. Kenny is just is just being so calm, though. Yeah, you're still tired from that fight with Eugene. Nope. <laughs> Maybe? Or maybe it's just Yuji's just a nice guy in general. That's why. It's just put into the most into the, the most fucked up situations possible. And uh, get a. Oh boy. Yeah. Yeah, Sora no Shiraiki? Akana Togame? I expected it to be a, 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 a... for the effect to be a lot more apparent. Ow! Oh, never mind. Reverse turret. Only Gojo, if I remember, only, only like, if I remember, only Gojo and Shoko were able to do it. Gojo can only do it on himself, and it's, all, it's only lim, and that's still limited. Oh, no.
Oh, cause... Oh, she's not, she's not warranted to hurt him because Kun is in him. <laughs> uh, no time to talk, start talk, keep talking about that. Um, that's befitting of Sukuna's, Sukuna's followers. Oh, this is looking bad. The fuck? <gasps> Wait. Yuki. Yeah. Oh, well, she has to take responsibility for what she fucking instilled in it. Well, it's not him anymore, but still. Ah, oh, fuck. It just ended. I just, it just occurred to me just to... Fuck. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, these episodes are so... These episodes are good. Like, even, like... Even given, like, not everything is seamless, it's so much fun to get into. <laughs> There's so much, there was so much action going on. There's no way I could cut, I can make good, some good, some good enough, you know, in battle, in, in battle comment. Three. I will say that the, um, the humor does, is a bit, eh, I, it's a little bit more annoying now, but I don't think it's too big a deal. I'm not going to talk about the main situation there. That. That, you can leave it up to yourselves. Me, I'm just saying like, oh, you just, me, f I'm here saying, oh, she just bitched out, didn't she? Yeah. Say it as you will. I think she, she totally bitched out on that one. Oh, but then again, she's probably not obliged to, she's not really as obliged as others to risk her life trying to say, uh, to address the situation. But then again, she's also planning. You know, she was talking about stocks and all. And I'm no, I'm not, I'm no, I'm no finance advisor. So, a warmer quilt tonight. Well, oh boy. Well, total is out for now, but at least we got another one. Huh? I'm sorry, I'm responding to someone. Oh, crappy crit. At least you got updated there. Um Yeah, this show this show is still fun. This is some fun. Like even though I don't think I have the bet, you know I, I'm not trying to I'm not trying to kill anyone's uh Thunder Year, but you know, of course remember when I mentioned I, I don't feel like I have as strong feelings as Jutsu Kazan as I used to. I still enjoy it. Again, I still really, I still quite like it. It's just that I don't feel like I have as the strong sense of liking for it. As well. it feels like it, it's disappointing. I feel like it was, it could have been like a, a, a long, at least a long term deal with this, with this show. But I, but it wasn't. But st I still don't have n any negative. Well, except for the movie. And well, in retrospect, I'm not even sure how to really. I really have particularly positive and well you know narrative wise like yeah it was fun but that's a whole nother thing and remember that was actually like like a test like a, a prequel like a like a sort of like a i don't want shot but it was more like the prequel before like the author deci decides to get down to it do the serialization I mean, I don't know the details on that, but that's the, that's, that's the what, that's what I figured. And of course, the anime is still better than the manga, by all means. Sometimes the manga has some things that are really hard 
some fights there are just some panels are really hard to follow in my opinion this one they just really extend the hell of it I uh, now I don't know did they extend Choso's fight uh cuz from my faint memory I don't remember Choso going all out like that during that during that you know bout with get with false ghetto aka Kenny I'm gonna be either calling him ghetto or Kenny at this point but yeah, Choso is basically Eugene's brother now. Well, by by self declaration. But I'll dig it. Eugene's just <laughs> the fact that I I really like what they did with it. I do like what they did with Choso. Like yeah, he's not just a lackey. He's someone with his own agency. That you know, when his brothers died, you know he felt vengeance for them. But after what his encounter with Eugene. And, you know, because he feels, because the way he resonates, he would recognize his brothers, but he resonates with, uh, with Eugene when Eugene was about to die, was, was died, or was about to die, or was that, or was the point of where one would normally die, but Eugene isn't, because Sukun is in him. He views him as his, he views him as his brother. And the whole, and the whole revelation with the, the fact that Choso's, Choso's... Ay, ay, ay. Okay, this is so fucking hard to really put this together because I can't say it fodder. Uh, but... Okay, so... Choso's mother is a human. It's a sp so the the, the, the... the main main fodder is sp is the cursed spirit and they were forced into some into intercourse. That's disgusting. And the one, the technical, the technical for metaphorical fodder, whatever you call it, is the false ghetto here, Noroshikamo. Now, Noroshikamo is, Noroshikamo is apparently the worst, the, 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 the nasty, you know, the most evil one in the sorcerer in the world. Well, but then again, the way... The way Kenny stated it, he's just like, oh, you can refer, I guess you can refer to me as, as Kamo. Which means that he's probably, that probably wasn't, he probably took over that Kamo at the time. To, 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 to inject, to impregnate that poor, that poor one, you know, Trust's poor mother over and over and over. And yeah, that's some nasty shit. That's some really nasty shit. The impre <laughs> Curse Spirits is one. Dealing with Curse Spirit, you know, trying to fight with Curse Spirits is one thing. Getting possessed by them is one thing. But intercourse with them, I, I, when I think back on them, like, god damn. But yeah, that's some, that's some lit shit, though. Uh, like, all the last. Uh, a lot of people, I'm pretty sure, are going to be mad at the part where Yuji doesn't get to, to finish off Mahito. It was Ghetto who just turned his ass into turned his ass into a Pokeball and just fused him into everyone else. He's literally like the the DNA, it's like a DNA splicer for whatever the fuck he he decided to unleash on the Muzumaki, which reminds me of that manga. But that manga, by the way, I totally hate it. By the way, <laughs> so Uzumaki and also Uzumaki thing too. Hold on. Uh, what the hell? So, Uzumaki is... Oh, so it's just... It is just the manga. I was wondering whether or not it was going to be an actual myth, but never mind. Um, but yeah, it's kind of fitting that it's called Uzumaki, because Uzumaki is not... From what I remember, unfortunate, faintly remember, fortunately, Uzumaki is a nasty conglomeration of... Of horror, uh, of nasty-looking, grotesque body horror shit, and it's not for the squeamish. And what you see here, hold on a sec. What you see here when Uzuma, when you know Uzumaki was unleashed, almost turning, almost turning poor uh, Miwa, who is now useless because apparently. She can no longer. She'll probably no longer be able to use the sword again. She literally. This is literally a nerf version of Final Gets Tensho, except 
there's no way she's going to be able to get it back, it seems. Unless the author figures something out along the way, if he bothers to care. I, I don't want to get into that. But it was a strong set, but Miwa isn't built. Was just not cut out for it. like she's just totally overpowered. It's she's not she's not the main protagonist. She's not the main heroine. There's no main heroine in there hitting here to be honest. I don't know if there is a set main protagonist either. <laughs> when you could when you're giving these main when you're giving these villains all the fucking all the fucking stops. It's great and the way it just the way that shit looked. And it, it was disgusting. Look at this. That's some. That's some fuck. That is definitely Uzumaki. That is definitely something on that damn manga. That is some. That is like. In a way, it's more grotesque than even the worst horror mo horror film that I remember. That I remember seeing. And I don't remember it, but it was just like. Not in the fact now those now that, those horror films like they're appealing because they jump because of jump scares like that's what Western or live action horror films usually do that's the go to thing and few not not many of them really get into a true sense of atmosphere when it comes to horror except for there 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 are some I still need a I I might. Like I'm pop, there's probably a blob them that I haven't really checked out, but um, yeah, that was in some nasty stuff. I do like that the other um, that the other that the other sorcerer students are trying to do all they can to stop you know, but it's just it's they they're just not in that league. Remember last like if they couldn't handle ghetto back then during the Zero movie, and only Yuta could. They, there was no chance for him there. Now that Kenny's taken over and he has no restraint. Because remember, past get the the real ghetto said he would doesn't want to to kill or hurt any of the anybody from the enemy from the academy. He does he doesn't want to. But this is no longer ghetto anymore. It's fuck. It's the fuck. It's it's a fuck. It's someone occupying his body, so they're in more fuck. So they're so they're more fucked than back than back then. And plus, they don't got tote. And plus, they're you no know, tote was out of commission. <laughs> and so, and then there's Irame, who you know Sukuna's follower. The only out he gets is that. Now maybe this is just my mistake, but Irame doesn't just you know didn't try to. To kill Yuji when she had the chance when Yuji went in to save Choso because Yuji has Kuna in him. That's why he she cannot directly attack, you know, um, directly attack him at that time. But I may also be wrong because she's willing to just put him down right there. Um. So, but but it's all but maybe it's also because you know. She either had no, she decided there was just no other choice and then, you know, Sukuna would just revive and elsewhere. Or, you know, um, I don't know, I mean, maybe I'm thinking about this way too hard. But I feel like it was more so, you know, the, initially is because, like, she's aware of Eugene being the, being the vessel. And, like, she's not just willing to, you know, try to kill Eugene at the time. Until she would, until the hands were forced. But I don't know. I, I might, I might admit. Again, I might miss him. I, I don't. I'm not uh, particularly sure. But uh, you know, how Rami was not initially, you know, trying to, trying to, you know, she, like when she had, when she had chose, when she had chose her at literal finger point, and Yuji went in. She didn't try to. You know, she didn't you know try to shoot, it, but let me see. I might miss some. I might miss something. Um,
Oh, he okay. Yeah, yeah, so he knew. He, so so she fi so um. He figured that he was really related to Suku. She was she had she was associated with Sukuna. That's why he kind of just jumped in, because because the because the ice particles in him weren't as con you know weren't as um severe. Hold on, I need to get this ship uh, pop. Hold on. Uh, let me, give me a sec. Only ice and only the ice in me is especially fragile. That means she didn't try to kill. That means she wasn't trying to kill him because she's aware Sukuna is in. Okay, so it confirms my suspicion. Hopefully, this doesn't get caught, Brad. But, um, but when she when a push came to shove, I mean, uh. When push came to shove, she just said, like, fuck it, I'm just gonna kill, I'm just gonna kill everyone, including the vessel. And then, of course, Yuki steps in, and this is gonna be an interesting interaction. I don't know if it's gonna be, like, she tries to, she is gonna be, like, um, is she gonna settle things here and there? Or is Kenny gonna be just, well, Kenny is just there to just go off with the prison realm that go, that, in which Gojo is sealed. So he's probably gonna try to dip out. So I don't think so. Yeah, but to have her to have her back, you know, would make sense because she kind of she is she does have responsibility in in this. You know, from one she set off she inadvertently set off ghetto. She inadvertently helped ghetto to that. No, she helped she inadvertently helped them to that to that ultimate decision. Two, Ghetto's body was not properly attended to, so that means she's still, which still you know prolongs you know prolongs her sense of responsibility because that body is still that body that of whom she set off at the time is still up and about and up and not just kicking, walking around, walking around causing chaos. He is literally, as Kusabe, he is literally, as Kusabe stated, the, the mastermind. So, yeah, this is gonna get, a, of course, it's not gonna get resolved within this, se all resolved in season. <laughs> We're going into another arc after, in a season three, whenever the hell that, that might, uh, start. And I hope it don't, they don't try to start too soon. It's, uh, you know, the production was already as messy as it is. I don't want these guys to suffer, but knowing these, knowing that fucking CEO, I really don't have high hope for that. I, I I can only just send prayers. I I have no power in that though. But yeah. But uh, okay, next week is seemingly the last episode. Uh, apparently, Jesus Christ is not gonna get the day off. Is not gonna get the holiday break off. Uh, unsurprisingly. So yeah. But I'll about do it though, you know. Again, correct me in the comments like if I missed anything or I missed said anything. Remember, I'm not too. F when when I'm in front of the camera, I'm not. I'll just say whatever. It's unadulterated, like. And I know I have this thing of where I, I mess up with what I was I'm about to what I'm trying to say. But you know, when you're up, when you're like. Like, see, right, right now, like, they do bear with it, though, man. I'm not trying to be, you know, too professional. Like, is, you know, I might as well try to be as honest as I can instead of trying to come, you know, think up of what lines to, uh, think of what premeditated lines to say beforehand. Um, but yeah, that's about do it, though. Uh, like, share, subscribe, and you know. Follow me on Twitter, support the YouTube channel, join Discord server, share the video around. But now I'll do it for today. Resistance signing off. See you next time. Take care. Stay safe, y'all. Have a great day. Peace.